These invasive species may be tiny, but the damage they cause is far greater than their size. Hemlock woolly adelgid are harming eastern hemlock trees. The insect feeds on the tree, it sucks the juices out of the tree, and when it does that, it eventually kills it. These insects do not have any native predators and can reproduce on their own without mating. So when they get introduced to a place, you, in theory, you just need one. Hemlock woolly adelgid are native to Asia. They were introduced to eastern North America in the 1950s. In 2010, they were found near Toronto, and in 2018, they spread across parts of Nova Scotia. Most recently, in 2022, larger populations have been found in the Niagara region and Coburg, Ontario. Based on the size of the populations we have in Ontario and Nova Scotia, that it's, it would be very unlikely for us to eliminate it from Canada. Populations are too big. Their infestation is mainly caused by wind, birds, and humans. They can get onto birds, birds move between trees, and then the insect crawls off and establishes a new population. And when it does that, it attaches itself to the tree, sticks its little mouth in, and starts feeding, and then it won't move for the rest of its life. It's just going to stay there. It is important to check firewood for these insects before transporting to a new location. This will limit their spread. If you're out in a forest, have a lint roller handy. When you come out of that forest, you should lint roller yourself because the insect can get on you and you can carry it around. So you should wash your boots and you should launder your clothes before you go to a forest again. Hemlock woolly adelgid can often be spotted by the wool they create to protect themselves. It looks similar to dryer lint. Sometimes, especially in the winter, storms can knock branches out of the trees, and so the, the, the branches will fall to the ground. So if you find hemlock branches on the ground, just pick them up and turn them over and look at them, and you can sometimes spot the insect there. Hemlock trees are an important part of survival for other animals like deer, birds, and fish. They're responsible for, for maintaining a lot, a lot of other ecosystem services, and so that's why we're, we're really concerned about them. If you spot hemlock woolly adelgid, be sure to report them to the Canadian Food Inspection Agency.